hello boys welcome to new video welcome to italy armorator so i did do a live stream to show the unit of italy but this is gonna be a short video to showcase the armorator of italy so let's go so basically we're gonna start with the logistic logistic italy get some a uh, lot of option in uh, in logistic you can have the the normal uh, p4 i guess the air command you have the fiat with the uh, one front only and uh, pretty speedy it's like your wheel uh, your wheel cv you will have also the grupa de controlado which is the um, is the infantry cv with the mg4 which is basically like an mg3 cpc uh, lvtc uh, you will have also leopard 1 i2 command a cargo 20 points a bigger cargo Shunok supply and the fob yeah so this is the logistic tab and you also get the helicopter command with very good optic and for hp all right for the infantry part which is the most important uh, part i think for uh, italy so we're gonna have the alpini alpini have a recoilless rifle m18 I'm pretty good get some uh pretty good range 9 ap not crazy after you have the alpine 90 uh better range uh double of the ap you get 18 which is pretty nice mg3 on top of that those guys are 15 men both of them shock infantry so pretty nice and yeah after you have the colonel muccini which is uh, basically i think it's my uh, mm, my favorite infantry for uh, italy at the moment those guys are pretty nice uh, did get some uh, good success you can have two card of those which is pretty nice the only problem is you don't get wheeled uh auto cannon transport in italy so your transport your wheel transport gonna be fiat and your mech transport gonna be some m113 uh fortunately you get the good one with a lot of front to spam which is good so yeah M uh, colonel muccini your uh, special force after you have your uh, m18 uh, the difference between the, to, those M18 and the M18 of the Alpin is the CRDA get some HE power, 1.5 HE, which is pretty nice, pretty helpful to uh, stop infantry with the long range. So yeah, uh, you can have them on a lot of transport as we talk about and some shitty helicopters. But, eh, they are not crazy Italian helicopters. <clears throat> they just do the job. After you have the uh, the shock, the shock version, the 15 points, the difference between those, uh, of course, you get double AP, you get um, you get more IG for the 15 points uh, one, and you get a uh, shock three, which is very, very important. Shock, very nice. Uh, after you have the country, the liner, which is your uh, basically your line infantry, 10 men, the regular squad, MG4, super bazooka. 10 AP, uh, not crazy, but it's just to, this is just your line infantry. After you have the line infantry plus APLAS, which I find pretty nice, honestly. Uh, line infantry plus APLAS for that price, 25 points com combination with the Fiat. Very good for motorized deck. Uh, you will have also the Sapper, classic Sapper on Fiat, M1 on 3, and classic VCC, which is a uh, M103 with a lot of armor basically. Um, you will have the Lagu Lagunare. Those are Marines. 15 man Marines. Uh, you have the with the Super Bajuka and the MG42. You have the the Marines, the Maro with the Bad Launcher. Shock Infantry, 15 man. It's like um, Moto Schutzen. No, not Moto Schutzen. It's not like motor shooting, but uh, hmm, I don't remember shock infantry like this. But yeah, shock infantry, 15 points with MG4, pretty nice. You have the Maro 90, same, but with APLAS for 10 more points, which is pretty nice. Those are uh, Marine only. Uh, pretty nice infantry. Uh, yeah, you will have also the Milan, base Milan. Same combination of transport as always, no wield, auto cannon transport, obviously. 
Milan 1, Milan 2, same. After you have the Parakudu TST, which is uh, basically a 10 man shock infantry with Super Bazooka, 15 points. Uh, same combination of the infantry. You have the 90 version with the Apelas, which is pretty nice. Those are the motorized. So uh, the Maro are the Marin and uh, the Para are the motorized. You get the 90. You get also the reservist, the classic uh, 10 man reservist with Super Bazooka. Pretty nice. And Stinger. So yeah, infantry top pretty strong. I did try the deck on Moto. I did enjoy. Pretty good. Uh, Probably not, uh, probably not the level of French motor, to be honest. But it's pretty close. It's pretty close. You have some good tools. In terms of support, <clears throat> you have a lot of rocket launcher. You have the Napalm version. This one, after you have the HE version. And uh, this thing does smoke as well, 7 HE. Like a budget uh, Palmen, uh, you will have the MLRS, the classic one. Uh, IHOC in uh, long range AA and uh, Hawk Pip to long range helicopter or long range plane 9 HE pretty nice it's not the Hawk Pip 3 it's the Hawk Pip 2 um, same as the Dodge one pretty uh, effective in terms of uh, mortar you have the Porta Morta Morte oh my god I want to learn Italian I like Italian language bro I do like Italian I kind of want to add clip in this. Can I want to add clip? Can I? Let's see. Mortar. Uh, you have a lot of choice of mortar. The normal mortar, the long range mortar, and the 5 HA mortar. Cost a lot. Cost a lot, but it's a 5 HA mortar. Pretty good. A lot of ammo in terms of. Uh, uh, quad browning in terms of track you get the quadra quadranta uh, quad browning m2 browning all right after you have the pivot scopy uh, no radar good spag the ab 29 25 millimeter the classic the automatic the automatic gets some change it's not anymore 3 he it's 2.5 now well, it's a bit of nerf, but yeah, it's pretty good. Still pretty good. It's still uh, automatic. You will have five of them, same as uh, Danish. And it's good to have uh, uh, automatic other than Danish. So yeah, after you will have a lot of choice of uh, a howitzer. You have the shitty one. You have the big howitzer with 5HE. I don't like the dispersion. And you have the classic uh, big howitzer. This one have the 9 HE, and you have the 10 HE, the M1, basically the M110, A2, and you will have your wheeled AA, the Spud Aspid, um, guided, um, motorized, very good air detection. Problem is you get only five uh, HP, it's Chirac, basically. The missile is good, five, uh, seven HE, do a lot of damage. This plus co automatic combination, you will have a guarantee to kill. Uh, six missile, pretty good, good speed, good uh, route speed as well. Motorized AA, so yeah, that's, so that's good to protect your motorized opener. All right, in terms of tank, you have the Leopard 1i2. After we will back to the big one, uh, you will have uh, M47, which is basically like Chariot or all the pattern uh, shitty tanks with the. Uh, little flag of italia they're pretty cute you have the m60 a1 uh, 11 ap no stabilizer just a shitty thanks to throw away and you have the m60 era m60 era should have 11 hp like come on it's an era tank doesn't doesn't get stabilizer but it gets 16 ap which is nice long range as well after you have the of series so you have the of 40, you have the OF 40 MK2 with the long range 15 AP, but stub, um, medium accuracy, 10 around a minute, which is great. So it's like um, eh, like a mix between Leopard and Shifting. Then you have the, the OF MK 2A1, uh, 2A, 
uh, 17 AP, pretty good accuracy, good stab, uh, not bad armor, medium optics, so yeah, pretty good, and uh, those tanks come with motor eyes as well, so very nice, after you have the 85 points, tank the OF MK3, with that 19 AP, 3 HE though, uh, medium optic, 65 speed, 13 front as the mixes and uh, double uh, double MG. So yeah, tank tab pretty nice. We didn't cover the last one and the biggest, uh, the C1 Ariet uh, 23 AP. Uh, probably like one to one, like Swedish one to one. Pretty good tank. You can have uh, two cards of them, uh, six or four on Harden, up to you. And yeah, this is the tank tab of Italia. All right. In terms of recon, helicopter recon, we get four choice there. We have unarmed, very good optic, 55 points. And we have the same version for five more points with the, with the MG and some rockets, which is pretty good. I think it's good. It's fine. It's a bit expensive in my opinion, but it's a very good uh, helicopter and uh, good speed. all right uh after you have the ab very good optic very small good speed shit speed sorry you have the ab uh igloo ufo exceptional optic uh yeah for people who like exceptional optic helicopter you have the chips gypsy recon with the little carabinier uh on the door pretty nice uh, very good optic, big speed, good off road speed. Uh, you have the same with the M2 Browning. After you have your recon infantry, uh, you have those guys, the Preskiliri, they are shock. Very good optic, good MG4, and pretty good uh, w w main weapon. So, yeah, you can have access to them with this transport. Uh, this transport is a recon, 50 points recon with MG42, uh, one front everywhere, good optic, size small, so you can escape to missile if you get lucky. If you play, you know, if you play hard, you can escape to missile. After you have the fake Maglan, the Kum Subin, those are uh, five man recoilless rifle, they are good. Uh, they got mini me. Uh, probably good for uh, sneaking and infiltration mission on the back line. Uh, you can have them on uh, all the combination plus the, the VM, the little uh, Protito recon. After you will have the five man recon with Super Pazuka, nothing crazy. Uh, after you have the Fiat uh, 6616 20mm. It's the same as the South Korean one. Uh, it gets the price buff. It's not anymore 45 points. It's just a story. Now you have also the 90 millimeter version, 3 HE, 8 AP, uh, bad accuracy. Terrible accuracy, but a big speed. Uh, it, it can be good. It can be good to use them at the opener. Uh, after you will have the Fiat 66 with the with the HVMS. HVMS gun, which is pretty nice, little automatic and wield as well. So pretty unique for Italy. After you will have the Leo 1A2 reconnaissance. I was thinking this thing is bad, but after playing with it, it's not bad. It's not bad. 11 AP, 10 around minutes. It do the job. It do the job of cleaning uh, transport and stuff like that. After you will have your B1 Suntour on the Rico. Rico. This thing is amazing. Uh, pretty good stop. Uh, pretty good AP. Pretty good accuracy. Three front. Big speed. Really big off road speed. 110 kmh. Very, very nice. So, yeah. This is your, uh, this is your moto, moto opener. This is your motto. All right. In terms of vehicle, let's just ping this one. In terms of vehicle, you will have the classic uh, Canonier, which is the Jeep. 
the italian jeep of course you should give me chips in italy what do you think guys they're gonna nerf them of course they're gonna give me more two card three of the chips with the ito after you have the c3060 um basically an hvms on the vehicle tab and you have the b1 Santoro. so that's why i did ping this one so you can can see for 10 points more you get the the the, the reconversion for 10 points less you get the vehicle version it gets medium optic which is pretty nice same armor the gun is pretty uh, similar nothing changed you just get the very good optic and you win uh, medium stealth so yeah pretty good you can mix them at the opener like you do an opener of b1 uh plus plus uh, this guy you know this guy to support the b1 Santorin. Mm, it can be pretty brutal it can be pretty pretty brutal we might do the, the full Santorin opener and the, the thing is i don't think they are nerfed for now you can have two card of 12 which is big 16 ap bro 16 ap after you have the Tiros, uh, which is like above Raketas, long range, cheap. It's pretty good. I did play versus that on my stream for people who did see my stream. And uh, yeah, it, this and above Raketas get buffed in the, in the patch because uh, this this DLC gonna come with the balance patch. A lot of units gonna change, you know. I cannot lick, but I can tell you, for example, Mech gonna lose the infantry. Um, uh, xp bonus and uh, they're gonna win uh, xp on vehicle tab so yeah bit in, bit of there for mech but i think it's um it's understandable mech mech is too powerful all right so we have uh, the the pharaohs we have two versions we have the version on the wheel pretty good we have the vtc tow uh a box with the tow basically the vtc ito box with the ito and vcc tow with the tow 2 missile all right in terms of helicopter uh italia doesn't get a lot of option they got this and they got the i don't know how to call that bro just an ito helicopter with 6 hp and the price is okay the speed is okay for this um okay it's just to clean something you know uh, behind the lines with the helicopter return after you have the mangusta mangusta with tow 2 and some uh, rocket after you will have the mangusta cbt with the vulcan the hydra the good rocket and for stinger pretty nice doesn't get stealth uh, like the tiger or french tiger but uh, still uh, still good helicopter for the, this price so yeah in terms of air and it's the last part of this uh, uh the uh, italian dlc make sure to insert that like button we go i'm gonna cover it on the channel with some gameplay and how to make decks we'll show you how to make mech decks how to make a moto decks with this and uh all the combination all right in terms of plane you get the harrier harrier with the maverick at gm pretty slow but it gets a lot of ecm and can defend itself versus plane after you will have the the f104 g which is a, a bomber for 400 kilometer uh, kg bomb which is a pretty big 2000 2000 kilo bomb bro get m9 as well good speed 10 ecm just enough to escape to one missile after you have the 104s i think it's an interceptor with the sparrow m9 uh, the thing with those you get them on veteran so three on three of those you can probably trade with the rafale you will lose one and you two are gonna escape so yeah it's good you have the bigger version uh, with the better missile we compare them you see this is sparrow this is a speed um it is a better missile long range uh better accuracy uh and the second missile the m9 uh 9l also pretty good for 20 points more 
and you win 10% more ACV. All right. After you have the bigger one, and the bigger one is 110 points, it gets five and four got my side. That's the big difference. And yeah, <clears throat> pretty good plane with the exceptional air detection interceptor, basically an interceptor. Right, let's do a check for you guys. So you can uh, pause and see the unit. All right, after you have the GR, uh, like a napalm, you know, it's a lot of napalm. It's 1k bomb. It's a lot of napalm. Should try like this one. Just um, one use plane, zero ACM. But yeah, it can, it can work. If you have plan <laughs> sorry for that i'm a bit sick um in term of uh, in term of uh at the gm you would get this gen g9 one a is a shitty at the gm you get two of those two 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 at the gm it's sa semi-active and 26 ap which is good the speed is not bad the ACM is pretty terrible the availability it's okay you get to on elite I guess if you want to hit something you need them on elite uh, after you will have the MB339 which is like a training plane honestly rocket planes for people who like rockets after you have the Ebili which is like your GBU um, well guided missile uh, plane got some ecm very good air detection good speed can defend itself get vulcan as well and the big boys is the tornado series for the italian they are their best plane basically the, you have the tornado with cluster you can have two cards so it means four is great five bomb of uh yeah pretty good bomb uh, pretty good ECM as well, air detection. After you have the Tornado ECR, and you have the Tornado EA, is the basically a copy of the ECR. High ECM, exceptional air detection, high speed, pretty good, um, pretty good plane. The only thing with those is the turn radius on those Tornado. They are so shit. Four hundred. Hmm. This one have really good turn. Yeah, this one have really have 300, bro. <clears throat> like A10 is 200. A10 is the best on the turn radius. All right, so yeah, the seed, and you have the SF to finish the DLC, guys. This toy that like button, Tornado ADF. This is the Italian superiority fighter. Uh, pretty good. Go on, veteran. Uh, with those interceptor so i think sf is good but attack plane in italy is pretty it's pretty bad it's pretty bad and uh but i think the all the the italian play around uh, the infantry and uh, the support so yeah hope you guys enjoyed that was italian armory tour make sure to destroy the like button make sure to support blitz war channel thanks for watching and uh, see you for um, streaming. I will do some streaming to stream Italia and get some gameplay. So see you soon. Take care.